hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to generate signed aab file and apk file for release so this is my flutter project and this is the project folder right here on the desktop so first of all open your web browser and search for flutter deployment and open the first link now scroll a little bit and here you can see two black lines for windows copy this code and now open your notepad so paste the copied link here so basically we have to paste this code into the command prompt but at first we need to specify the path we need to download and save there so remove this path till username and open your project folder and then go to the android file and open the app file and copy this link the address and copy and paste in right here before the upload slash and paste here like this that's it now you can copy this all and open your command prompt and paste right in here and now you need to enter a password so I'm going to write a simple password but you have to write a uh, strong password so I'm just going to write here one two three four five six seven eight and click enter now again I'm going to write the same password one two three four five six seven eight and again click enter now you can write here your first name and last name and click enter and you can leave and click enter I'm going to leave here empty because I'm not working for any organization so click enter again I'm going to click enter without any information again click enter enter and here you have to type yes and hit enter now you have to type the same password as above so I'm going to write to one two three four five six seven eight and hit enter again one two three four five six seven eight and hit enter so as you can see the key store file is downloaded and you can close this now and you can see the upload key store file is downloaded into the app folder of my project so you can close your notepad now go back to the flutter deployment page on your web browser and scroll a little bit so as you can see now you have to go to the your vs code and you have to create a new file that is key.properties in your android folder so open your vs code and in the android folder create a new file key.properties and in here you have to copy and paste this code so copy this code and paste in key.properties file and here again you are going to write your password which you entered in the command prompt so i'm going to write my password that is one two three four five six seven eight and once again here you have to write your password one two three four five six seven eight and in the last one you have to write the location of your file so you can remove all this till here and so as you remembered our file is in the app folder of our project so we have to copy this location and paste so i'm just simply going to type dot dot slash app and that's it and you can save by control s and close this file so now go back to your web browser and scroll a little bit so now you have to open your build.gradle file which is in the app level so open your vs code and inside the android folder open the app and here is your build.gradle file so go back to your web browser and copy this code and paste it right here above the android so i'm going to paste it here 
and make sure to remove these spaces that's it and save this file now go back to your web browser and scroll a little bit so as you can see the second now find the build types block in your build gradle file which is maybe right here yes and delete this now go back to your web browser and the blue the second code copy this all code and paste here that's it for the build gradle file you can save by control s and close this now go back to your web browser so from here we are done and so now open your terminal on vs code in your project folder click here the new terminal and type here flutter build app bundle and hit enter it uh, usually takes some minutes sometimes seconds it depends on the size of your application so as you can see by entering this command flutter build app bundle we have created the .aab file so in the project folder you can go to this location so open your project folder and open the build then app then the outputs in here you can see the bundle and release so this is the your release.aab file and you can upload this file onto the play store so every can everyone can download and install this application on, onto their phone on their android phone and so this is the way to create the .aab file and uh, so now we are going to create the apk file so open your vs code and type here flutter build apk and hit enter by this command it will generate the apk file so this apk file you from by by this apk file you will be able to install the app directly onto your phone or any other phone but the flutter build app bundle command will generate the aab file and that is for the play store to upload so once again it's gonna take some time so as you can see the .abk file is created now go to this location in your project folder and the apk release and this is the release version of your apk file and by this you can install on any device so in this tutorial we signed our app to the release version and also we generated the app bundle file and apk file so i hope this video might help you and i hope you like this video so make sure to press the like button and subscribe button and thank you for watching